Hey, I'm Myers, and I uh, just want to do another video um, about holidays coming up. Uh, so, as you guys know, this year uh, we lost our daughter Ashley uh, in February, and so this is going to be our first holidays without uh, Ashley. Um, so it's it's weird. It, uh, my wife on her phone is keeping lists of who she's bought presents for and this and that and she keeps looking at it thinking there's I'm, I'm missing somebody oh it's Ashley uh, you know so there's a void there for us and um, from the get go when Ashley died like uh we asked for uh, acts of kindness in honor of Ashley. Just, you know, you don't need to spend a lot of money. You don't, uh, I mean, like, Ashley never had any money. She did it, you know, like, um, she never asked for anything. Um, there were times when she'd come see us and uh, Rhonda would help her pack her car or whatever, and uh, she, uh, leave or whatever and you know she'd get a half hour or so down the road and uh Rhonda would call her and tell her look under the sun visor and you know Rhonda would slip fifty dollars or hundred dollars whatever in there and uh you know and Ashley just she never knew how to react to somebody giving her something or doing something for her or you know she when she needed needed stuff she wouldn't ask for it. you know so friend of ours uh, whose child came out as trans uh, you know posted something uh, a website for trans Santa uh, where trans kids are uh, posting their Christmas wish list uh, on Amazon uh, they're, they're like Amazon wish list for these trans kids. You could go on this. Uh, I'm going to put a link in the description of this video. Um, you could go on there and uh, fuck this one girl was asking for uh, toilet paper. It was her top gift. But she... <laughs> reminds me a lot of Ashley because Ashley would never ask for anything. So. You know, when somebody's top gift, the, the thing they want most for Christmas is toilet paper. You know, um, someone's top gift was uh, a record from Ghost. You know, me? me? I, I'm going to buy a fucking record for a kid. You know, I'm not a fan of Ghost, but I mean, hopefully the kid learns better taste in music at some point. But, uh... You know, it's Christmas. I, I, I forgive you. the kids' bad taste of music, you know. Um, so, anyways. Uh, you know, when Ashley, you know, like, even when she didn't have money or whatever, uh, 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 she used to go to, like, shelters and pet dogs and cats or whatever just, you know, to, uh, you know, love on the stray dogs and cats or whatever like she, she's trying to contribute something to society so you know that sort of light like the sort of spark says she's not here you know um ron and i are doing our best to try to pick that up to you know I can tell you very honestly that Ashley's death has really softened me. It made me more forgiving. And, uh, yeah, I, I, I'm just not as bitter as I used to be. So, uh, anyways, uh, if you can, if you're able to do an act of kindness for in honor of my daughter Ashley uh, you know I'm going to post a link to that trans Santa thing um, please uh, you know all these kids 
most of these things, that, I mean, the one kid I bought, uh, I don't know, like a frying pan for like 12 bucks or something. Uh, you know, uh, they want really basic stuff. And, you know, um, you know, so they're, they're kids, you know, and the, the hard reality of uh, trans kids is when most trans kids come out, they are disowned by their families and thrown out of their houses, you know. Our daughter didn't come out to us until she was 22 because, you know, they know that they know that most the reality for most of these kids is they're disowned by their families and thrown out of their homes and you know so there's a lot of fear in those kids and uh, that's such a motherfucker you know it, all this political fucking anti-trans bullshit or whatever of you know you know, these motherfuckers call themselves Christians, but they hide, they hide behind, I'm a good Christian to promote hate and fucking, you know, they want these people, to, uh, these kids to live in fear. And there's nothing honorable or Christ-like about, uh, you know, like I saw a tweet, when, I'm not on Twitter, but somebody repost a tweet of some right wing loony is like Jesus never used pronouns and there's a, the quote from Mark of uh, you know, the passage says I am the one they call he and uh, you know like yeah he, he Jesus used fucking pronouns get, get over your fucking I mean there's some never mind um but yeah, if you could do an act of kindness for Ashley this Christmas, look look at this website, okay? And the way it's set up, you know, you just you you can click on these kids' Christmas list, and you know, um, they're not, you know, when when a pair of cargo pants is their top ask, you know, like a $25 pair of cargo pants or whatever. You know, like, you know, I know money's tight for a lot of us or whatever, but, you know, if you can, you know, just throwing it out there. Anyways, uh, and, you know, if some trans kid sees this and needs, you know, uh, mama bear to dote on you and you know um, whatever like message us me message info at suguitars.com and um, and I'll put you in touch with my wife Rhonda and uh, you know like cause the, the void in our lives that because we don't have Ashley, we need to fill it somehow, you know, so, um, you know, we want to be that supportive presence for somebody, so, anyways, Merry Christmas, check the link that I'm putting in the description here, and, uh, you know, um, I'm just sitting here, Minnesota, where... We got our second snow of the season. Uh, we got a little dusting just before Halloween. And um, today, uh, I don't know, um, it's a little dusting. It, it's sticking to the ground because it's been cold for a while. But, uh, you know, it's, it's not crazy. Listen to a great Minnesota band, the Magnolias from Minneapolis. I believe they're playing in the cities tonight, the 25th uh, of November. So... If you're in cities, fan of the Magnolias, go say hi to John Freeman for me. Um, I won't be making it up there tonight, but, you know, um, yeah, love the Magnolias. Great band. Um, they've been part of my life for, you know, since my adolescence. You know, uh, they used to come down to see so much, we thought they were a local band or treated like I'm like a local band because... They were just around a lot, and uh, 
so they were great you know so anyways uh thanks for watching and uh please look at the website i'm linking in the description of this video